All right, before the year ends, right now it's December 31st, 2012, uh, I just want to show a quick video uh, to hopefully dispel any accusations of piracy and all that, that, I, that somehow, supposedly, I like to get bootleg stuff off the internet or to bootleg things. Uh, here's the 20th anniversary edition of the first Robocop on DVD. Too bad I didn't get it on Blu-ray. Well, I didn't have a Blu-ray player at the time, and nobody else really did either. See, so I got that on DVD. I got the combo pack of uh, of Heat on uh, DVD and Blu-ray. This is the DVD because the Blu-ray is actually in the other room. That Friday the 13th, I haven't watched yet. Got that on DVD. <coughs> um, got Red Heat on DVD. I'm thinking about getting it on Blu-ray. Uh, Gremlins, uh, special edition on DVD. Evil Dead 2 on DVD. Uh, Robocop 3 on DVD. Might get it on Blu-ray. Uh, the Rob Zombie 2 disc special edition of Halloween on DVD. Uh, Super Mario Brothers on DVD. No, that's not a DVD. That's a game. That's Naruto. It's not even mine. Lord of the Rings. That's not mine. That's on GameCube. Um, South Park Season 2 on DVD. <coughs> South Park Season 5 DVD. Bottom in the store. Uh, let's see. Austin Powers and Goldmember, which is the third Austin Powers movie. Got that on DVD. Seventh season of uh, South Park on DVD. It's a second South Park season that I bought on DVD. Uh, South Park Season 3 on DVD. <coughs> South Park Season 6 on DVD. I seriously hope I never get accused of, like, just trying to get stuff off the internet for free because I spent so much money buying all the stuff. South Park Season 4 on DVD. <coughs> um, Ace Ventura Pet Detective on DVD. Uh, Trading Places on DVD. Um... Let's see, this is the second time I bought Ghostbusters. I got the Ghostbusters 1 and 2 double feature gift set on, d on DVD. Might buy it on Blu-ray also. Ace Ventura, When Nature Calls. It's the second Ace Ventura movie on DVD. Behind Enemy Lines. I might eventually get that on Blu-ray, but this is DVD. Um... American History X. I have it on DVD right here, and I have it on Blu-ray. Uh, Terminator 3, Rise of the Machines. I have this on DVD and Blu-ray. <coughs> Terminator Salvation. I have this on DVD and Blu-ray. Green Zone, DVD. Uh, RoboCop 2. Now I have the RoboCop movie. I have it on VHS. I have the first RoboCop on VHS and DVD. I have RoboCop 2 on VHS and DVD. I've had it on VHS for 14 years. I've had it on DVD for a few years now. Let's see. G.I. Joe, yeah, I got it on DVD and Blu-ray. Uh, 12 Angry Men, I only have it on DVD. Uh, first Austin Powers movie, have it on DVD. Deja Vu, I have it only on DVD. It might get on Blu-ray. The Ringer, I just have it on DVD. Smurfs on DVD. Uh, Spider-Man, the 2002 movie on DVD. Evil Dead Ultimate Edition on DVD. And 
นะเงี้ย40 year anniversary well the 40 years of everlasting fun edition uh, which is special edition of Willy Wonka and the Chocolate Factory on DVD I might get on oh yeah I'll probably get on Blu-ray uh, Wayne's World 2 got it on DVD I can't remember if I got I think I got it on VHS also I'm not sure uh, Chappelle show first season on DVD uh, Transformers uh, 2007 movie I have it on DVD and I have it on Blu-ray no that's actually the special edition there uh, Logan's Run I have it on DVD I'm thinking about getting it on Blu-ray They Live, I only have it on DVD. I don't know if they make it on Blu-ray yet. South Park Movie, got it on DVD. Uh, Super Mario World on DVD. <clears throat> Alright, here we go the special edition of the first Terminator movie on DVD very worthwhile and this is uh, very valuable to my collection um, have it on DVD and um, I got the extreme edition of uh, Terminator 2 on DVD like everybody had this it was on I, I got a, I got a I got Terminator 2 on Okay, I got the first Terminator movie on VHS. I got it on DVD and I got it on Blu-ray. Got Terminator 2 uh, on VHS. I got the I got the Ultimate Edition DVD and then I got the Extreme Edition DVD of Terminator 2 and I got the Skynet Edition of Terminator 2 on Blu-ray. There's the uh, there's the label for it. Matter of fact, I just need to prove this. <clears throat> I need to go in and show you my Blu-ray movies because I keep telling you about them, but uh, but you actually don't get to see them. You know that light is heating up and it's not quite bright enough in here. <clears throat> uh, here we go. Down here at the bottom, I have. G.I. Joe on Blu-ray. I got Valkyrie on Blu-ray. Uh, Tron Legacy on Blu-ray, which is really, really good. The Matrix, Ultimate Matrix Edition or whatever on Blu-ray. Of course, I got the first Matrix on VHS and DVD. I also have it on Blu-ray. American Beauty. Um, American Beauty on Blu-ray. Uh, two, mi two movie uh, mega collection of Transformers on Blu-ray, which is Transformers 1 and 2. Uh, Captain America, the, the limited uh, 3D edition on Blu-ray for Captain America. Saving Private Ryan Sapphire series on Blu-ray. The um, triple feature of Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles um, on, uh, on uh, Blu-ray. It's got... Uh, First Ninja Turtles, Second Ninja Turtles, and in, in the Third Ninja Turtles movie on Blu-ray. Uh, Office Space. Um, Office Space on Blu-ray. I also have it on DVD. Transformers: Dark of the uh, Dark of the Moon, which is the third Transformers movie. Uh, limited 3D edition on Blu-ray. Wizard of Oz: 70th Anniversary Edition on Blu-ray. American History X on Blu-ray. Um, Live Free or Die Hard on Blu-ray. I also have it on DVD. There's Heat on Blu-ray. I told you I had the two-pack. GoldenEye, I have it on VHS, DVD, and Blu-ray. Uh, it's a great pumpkin. Charlie Brown on DVD and Blu-ray as a combo pack. First Wayne's World, I have it on VHS. I got it, matter of fact, I got it right at 20 years ago, the Christmas of uh, 1992 on uh, VHS. So I've had the VHS for 20 years. Uh, I've had the DVD for like five or six, maybe, yeah, years. 
of Wayne's World, the first Wayne's World. Well, I got it on uh, Blu-ray also. I right, see the blue packaging. Um, this is Doubtfire. I have it on VHS and uh, and Blu-ray. Uh, the original Tron classic. I got it on. I got the two disc special. Well, I got special edition. It's on DVD and uh, I got it on Blu-ray and DVD. Battle Los Angeles. I just got it on Blu-ray. Here we go. Terminator Salvation. Director's cut on Blu-ray. Still haven't opened it yet. Terminator 3, Rise of the Machines on Blu-ray. Uh, Terminator 2, right there. T2 Skynet Edition on Blu-ray. Um, now I got the triple feature of Commando, Predator, and the first Terminator on Blu-ray. And I got Rocketeer on VHS uh, from 20 years ago in the early 1990s. Uh, I got it on DVD and I got it on Blu-ray. Now this is the 20th anniversary edition on Blu-ray. It has no special features, which pissed me off. Um, I'm just seeing now. Here's my VHS collection. I got a bunch of VHS movies. Uh, Saving Private Ryan on VHS. Um, uh, Home Alone. I just bought it on Blu-ray last night. I'll show you that. Um, let's see, um, now here we go, Rocketeer right there on VHS. Uh, here's some other movies and stuff, oh yeah, I got Evil Dead on VHS also. Um, and, uh, I got, um, Army of Darkness on DVD twice. One is because a friend gave it to me, and then, you know, years ago, and then second, um, as I bought it on DVD. Now you see back here this Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles movie right there and uh, where the beam is focused on and yeah, I moved it off a little bit. Um, I got that on VHS DVD and Blu-ray. <clears throat> um, you know I even got the first three uh, Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles games on Nintendo. Um, here's the first Ninja Turtle game on. Well, I'll just show you. First Ninja Turtle game on NES. Second Ninja Turtle game on NES. Now, I've had this for. Yeah, 20 years now, because I think my grandpa got me this game. Uh, Christmas of 92, I think it was, yeah. Yeah, Ninja Turtles 2, the arcade game, you know, on NES. And Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles 3, the Manhattan Project, on NES. Now, I believe... I may have this one twice, because my friend Tom gave it to me last month. Well, almost two months ago, in uh, early November. No, it was early December. Anyway. And then he had this one also, so I got this one twice. Um, I have like three of these. I have, I think, two of these because I, I bought one and then I think Tom gave me one. And then I think I have three of these because I got this one for Christmas of like... Oh gosh, was it 92 or whatever? I forget. Um, I think. Super Mario Brothers 3. And then I bought one at the, at the pawn shop a few years back back in like 2005 or whatever and then my friend Tom gave me one so I got th I believe I got three of those uh, I got Maniac Mansion twice I bought this back in 2000 wait is this the one that I had originally I think it is see the I don't remember mine saying that right there. Based on the original Lucasfilm games, see the TV version on the Family Channel. I don't remember mine having that. Cause see, Tom, he he had that on his too. Now I now I got Castlevania one on um on NES, you know, the first Castlevania, and yeah, Tom had Maniac Mansion. I got Maniac Mansion, but he gave me a second one. I think the same thing for first Castlevania. Uh, I bought River City Ransom years ago, and then he got it and, uh, years ago, and then he gave it to me, so I got two of these now. Um, 
Um, <clears throat> I got the original Gold Zelda one. I got it from the mid 1990s. Uh, well, that's when I bought it. Now it's from the 1980s. Uh, Zelda 2: Adventures of Link. I remember back in the early 1990s playing this very game that's in my hand is one that me and Philip Wiseman and Jason Engelman we were all playing back in the early 1990s and it still has our save game files on there to this day uh, well I need to check it just to make sure the battery hasn't ran down um, yeah but I got the gold the first uh, well I got the first Zelda in gold second Zelda in gold uh, I got the uh, first Metroid pixelated uh, graphics. Uh, now my friend Tom gave me one of these too, so I got two just like this. Uh, I think he had Kung Fu also, but I've got it, and he gave me another one. Um, uh, I got Kid Icarus pixelated label. It took me a while to get that. I got Excite Bike pixelated label. Uh, pinball, pixelated label, and see back the earliest Nintendo games had these pixelated labels on there, and it was great. I loved it a lot. Um, Rad Racer, I think I got two of these. Um, pixelated label, Hogan's Alley, pixelated label. I think I got two of these because Tom gave me one. Uh, I got a bunch of these classics. Uh, here's a bunch of my Super Nintendo games there, and. And uh, here's a bunch of my movies on DVD. Uh, Bill's Gun Shop. I bought four of these DVDs all at one time because they were only two bucks each. Uh, so I bought four of these and four of the and, and I, yeah, I got four of these in a box. Three for me and then one for a friend of mine and all that because they were so cheap. I figured, well, might as well make it worth the shipping cost because the shipping costs more than the movie. So I bought four movies to make it worth a while. Um, oh yeah, yeah. Um, told you I had Rocketeer on uh, DVD. Yeah, here it is. Rocketeer on DVD. Here's the Rocketeer on VHS. And here is the Rocketeer on Blu-ray. So. Uh, Rocketeer on, um, well, I'll just get it out there. Uh, if, if there's a movie that I like enough, I'll buy it multiple times. There we go. The Rocketeer on VHS that I've had for 20 years. The Rocketeer on DVD that I've got earlier this year in 2012. And then the 20th anniversary of the Rocketeer on Blu-ray. So I got VHS, DVD, and Blu-ray. Um, yeah, same movie. Yeah, same movie. Bought it three different times. Um, same thing for me on the Terminator movies and all that. Um, now I don't have Fight Club on VHS, but I do have it on DVD. Um, matter of fact, I got the for Fight Club. I got the book. Oh, no! Oh, I got the Fight Club Blu-ray around here somewhere. Maybe it's in the other room. Um, there we go, Fight Club. Oh yeah, here's some of my Super Nintendo and Nintendo games. Oh yeah, I forgot to mention. <laughs> I forgot to mention. Got the Rocketeer on Super Nintendo. Yeah, the Rocketeer. I also like that alternate cover too, that's pretty good. And check this out. Now here's the one that I originally bought, or no, I got this for Christmas of 1991. My dad got it for me because my dad actually got me into the Rocketeer, and I bought this one again in 2005. So you look at this. I have identical copies of the Rocketeer on NES both times, and I have it on Super NES and all that. 
Um, oh, one of my favorite games of all time, Super Metroid. Oh yeah, on Super Nintendo. Um, where, where did some of my games go? Look at these games. At? What am I missing? Um, oh, that's right. Felix the Cat and Darkwing Duck. And then Galaga. Okay. Oh yeah, I got Golf Pixelated Label. I got... I believe I got two of the Super Mario World. Um... Oh yeah, I got two of these Game Genies for NES. Get my Zen over here. Oh yeah, Ultraman. Uh, just a few days ago, I got a Christmas story on Blu-ray, and I also have it factory sealed on VHS. Um, oh yeah, I got Mrs. Doubtfire on that VHS also. Ah, here we go. Christmas story, factory sealed. Now anybody could could shrink wrap this. However, if you look at the um, at the wrapping on it, I don't know if you can see it. There's the Warner Brothers seal right there. So not just anybody could get that Warner Brothers seal, Warner Home Video. So it's factory sealed. That's why I bought it on uh, Blu-ray to, to actually watch. Um, and uh, some games, if I really like them a whole lot, I'll I'll um, I'll buy them multiple times. Now I want to show you Fight Club. Okay, as you can see, I have Fight Club on DVD. It's just a standard edition. Then I have the 10th anniversary edition of Fight Club on Blu-ray. Uh, I actually have another one of these on Blu-ray. I bought it twice. Thinking about buying it a third time because I like it so much. And I like this movie so much that I actually have a factory sealed 10th anniversary Blu-ray edition of Fight Club uh, put in a fireproof safe. Uh, so that I'll always have it, presumably, and uh, regardless of what happens. Um, a few movies are that important to me. Um, <clears throat> oh, it went up one degree in here. It went up from 57 to 58. Um, Yes, I got the um, the four. I got all four of the Lethal Weapon movies on DVD. I also have all four of them on blue on uh, VHS. One of these days I might get them on Blu-ray. Uh, Transformers season one on uh, DVD. Yeah, it's a cartoon. Uh, to all my friends on shore or offshore. You no, know, onshore. Okay. Oh yeah, I have Lethal Weapon 4 on DVD twice. Got it in that, uh, that, uh, the four pack there. Yeah, got it here. So I bought it twice. Uh, <clears throat> second Rob Zombie Halloween movie. Uh, Super Mario Brothers, uh, Super Show on DVD. Um, uh, Battle of the Bulge on DVD. Oh yeah, told you I had Ninja Turtles on VHS, DVD, and Blu-ray. Yeah, I got the four feet. I got all the Ninja Turtles movies on DVD right here. I also showed you how I got them on uh, Blu-ray, except for the 2007 one. I don't got that. Here's uh, Magnum Force on VH or DVD. I'm sorry. Spider-Man 3 DVD. 
Uh, yeah, I showed you how I got Live Free or Die Hard on uh, Blu-ray, but I also got on DVD the Collector's Edition. Um, Happy Gilmore on uh, Special Edition on DVD. Might get on Blu-ray also. Um, V for Vendetta. I only have it on uh, the Special Two Disc Edition on DVD. I don't think I got it on Blu-ray. Uh, Army of Darkness. Yeah. Uh, Screwhead Edition on DVD. Might get it on Blu-ray. It's just a few dollars more. Demolition Man on DVD, and I also I believe I got it on VHS also. Spider-Man 2 DVD. Um, Days of Confused on DVD. Uh, flashback Edition. I might get it on Blu-ray if they have it. Some episodes of that 70s show on DVD. Uh, He-Man Bastards of the Universe on a DVD. Uh, Quantum of Solace. Uh, two disc special edition on DVD. Might get it on Blu-ray. Oh, told you I had Transformers uh, Revenge of the Fallen. Got two disc special edition on DVD. Also got it on Blu-ray. Um, Minority Report. <laughs> uh, <laughs> yep. Um, on DVD. Might get it on Blu-ray also. Ah! Wayne's World! Uh, told you I had it on Blu-ray. Yep. Got the widescreen collection on, uh, DVD. So I got Wayne's World on DVD and Blu-ray. And VHS. But I don't feel like digging up my VHS movies. Uh, Lawnmower Man 1 and 2 on DVD. Um... Clue, I got Clue on DVD, and I'd probably like to buy it on Blu-ray, uh, if I could find it somewhere. Um, Charlie Wilson's War, I got the book and the DVD. Oh, here it is, here it is, here it is. This took me years to find. Uh, this was put out more than a decade ago in 2001. You see that? Terminator 2 Ulti Ultimate Edition on DVD. I think this was the first special edition of Terminator 2. And, um, <clears throat> it's even got documentaries and all that on there. Uh, I walked into Movie Gallery back in the fall of 2006 and, uh, saw this shiny thing that caught my attention. I'm like, well, what's that? Terminator 2 Ultimate Edition on DVD, factory sealed. Now, I opened it since then and watched it, but the point is. Um, oh, yeah, Dead Presidents. I got this on Laserdisc and DVD. Um, Predator 2. Oh, yeah, I got it on DVD. I'll probably get it on Blu ray also. It's pretty cool. Uh, now, I got the first Predator movie somewhere. Oh, yeah, here's The Matrix. Bought them on DVD twice. And I got them on Blu-ray. Yeah. I'm just making the, this video because I'm actually digging through here. Oh, Goldeneye. I got on VHS, DVD, and Blu-ray. Um, and, um... Oh yeah, the Golden Child. I might get that on Blu-ray. It's pretty cool. Got it on DVD.